welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to another vlog. I am actually back from class now. I had class super early this morning, so I was super duper rushed, but I got back from class. It's like, what, 12.30 now? And I have the rest of the day to kind of like get my school stuff done. So it's beautiful outside, like sun is shining. It is so beautiful out. So I went ahead and put on a swimsuit and just like throw on some shorts over top so that I could get some sun on my legs. And I don't know, it's just something about like being out in the sun and we have a table that we can work at. So I'm gonna like try and get all my school stuff together and sit at the table, get some of that done for a little bit. And then there's honestly a lot of school stuff that I need to get done. I'm gonna try and get myself organized. I'll show you guys how I kind of get organized at the beginning of a semester. This one's a little bit different cause it's like just a couple of short summer classes, but I still wanna get myself organized and there's a lot of schoolwork I have to do. I have class again tomorrow, so I need to get some stuff done for that and order textbooks, just like all the crazy beginning of the semester things I need to get done and I'm gonna go do it outside. So I'm grabbing all my stuff. It's a little while later now. I got a shower actually because I was just like stinky from laying outside. I actually didn't end up doing like any schoolwork when I was laying outside. I literally like just laid outside and like had my school stuff sitting there. So it's like, I don't know, I was thinking about it but not really doing any of it. But I did get some sun so that was good. It felt good to just like lay in the sun for a little bit. And I just hopped out of the shower. I needed to wash my hair today anyway. I needed to get a shower. So figured I'd just do that now. It feels so good first off. I love like clean hair. Like there's something about freshly washed hair that feels so good. You guys ask a lot about the products that I use um, on my hair and stuff and the stuff that I've been using for like ever is the Clairol Shimmer Brights purple shampoo and then I was like some other purple shampoos that I've used just like generic brands. I didn't really think it mattered. It was all like knockoff stuff of the Clairol Shimmer Brights and that is like a cheaper purple shampoo but it's what my hair lady recommended when I first went like this color. I don't even think you guys can really see it. Hair color a little bit better. I mean it's uh it's wet right now but the purple shampoo just like keeps it toned because I like like the ashy blonde color. So I've been using the purple shampoo that I just told you guys about and I think it was like drying the heck out of my hair. I'm not sure. I tried a different shampoo today. It was like a Joico blonde something that a girl from work gave me a little sample of to try and I think I'm gonna have to get like new shampoo and conditioner because it like it feels so much better already. I don't know. I've been using that stuff for like years. See, I'm starting to think maybe it's worth it to spend on shampoo. Let me let me know what you guys think. I would I'm like very curious. But my hair feels like a ton better. So I think I'm gonna like try and find a new purple shampoo this weekend. I'll bring you guys along for that. I just got out of the sun and I'm gonna go finally actually do some score now that it's taken me freaking hours. I just got one of my textbooks in the mail. This is like about human development. So this is one of the books that I needed for my one class that I finally got in. I'm waiting for two more textbooks to come in that I need, but at least I got one of them. Not the most important one, the most important one I just ordered today. So I'm kind of SOL on that one. I just want to show you guys real quick how I'm organizing for this summer semester. I'm in technically two classes. So like one is an online hybrid course. I don't know if I explained this very well before. I'm in one online hybrid course. So that meets like a couple times, but it's like an eight week course. Like it's a little bit of a longer summer course, but it's like mostly online. And then there's another one that is like in person for I think like five weeks it is. So that'll be to like mid July that I'm in and then from late July to the end of August, I'll be in another online, no, I think that one's in person, another in-person class. So it's kind of like jumbled up, but for right now, this is kind of what I'm doing. Actually, do I wanna do that? That doesn't seem like that makes very much sense to me. It's fine, I'll make it work. So basically I just have these two folders. I use different colors so that I can like categorize them in my brain. And then I always take a little sheet protector and use that. I put that in the prongs and then that is just the syllabus. So it's like separate from all my other papers. And then any other handouts that they give, I just put in here. That's pretty much this folder. Same thing with this one, just any handouts will go in here. And then like most importantly is the syllabus and that always goes in the middle, easiest to get to. And I'm just like having it separate. I think it protects it really well. So I have my two folders and then I was gonna do a notebook for each course, but there's no way I'm gonna fill up a whole one of these 
for each course so I just decided to split it so I took like two post-it notes and like halfway through I sticky so like the pink one will be for the pink class folder and this one will be for the green class folder the two classes that I'm taking I don't really know exactly what they're called the two classes I'm taking one is like a development class for children and then the other one is about teaching inclusive basically so it kind of goes over the basics of teaching which honestly I think I'm really gonna like both of them the one about like teaching inclusively seems to be a lot of just like general teaching stuff and then the developmental one is a lot of stuff that I already did as a psychology major so that's pretty cool so I'm organized and then I'm not really gonna write anything in my planner normally I'll take my planner and as you guys can see like my planner is pretty empty this is for the month of July normally I would go through and write like all the assignments I have due when it's due all that good stuff but for my summer classes I'm not gonna do that because it's only two classes so it's not that much to keep track of it's not as much to keep track of I'll just go off the syllabus and that'll like work fine for me and also the one class like doesn't really have any like hard due dates so it'd be kind of tricky to be writing them all in so I don't have to do that which is actually pretty nice so I'm all organized for my classes now I feel much better now I was like all discombobulated yesterday because I never got like organized for my classes so for the next little bit there's a couple things that I have to do since I'm like new to the university I need to just like get some things done for the program for like just being a new student on a new campus I just need to like get some of that general stuff done and submit it so I'm gonna go do all that boring stuff now and video mostly edited I need to go through and do like some final touches but for the most part I got my video all done which is super good but I want to do I found this thing on Pinterest on how to make these healthy breakfast things let me pull it up okay so they're oatmeal breakfast muffins I'll link the thing down below for you guys if you guys want to go check it out but I'm gonna make those I think because as I'm sure you guys have noticed from like just just the beginning of these school vlogs one the school's like decently far away so it is like quite a drive and I just am bad about planning enough drive time for things and two I'm just terribly awful about getting anywhere on time I don't know what it is I it doesn't matter how much time I plan ahead it's just like I'm always rushed I get there on time let me see that I get there on time I just suck at like like being relaxed and chill in the morning I'm always like oh my gosh I have to hurry and get there and I'm just like on one every morning so I don't normally have time to eat my breakfast so I think I'm gonna make these muffins because they'll be like really easy to just throw in a bag and eat in the car that way I can still eat breakfast on the way to school I think that'll be like a really nice thing to do I can sit and jam to my music listen to a podcast and eat my muffins so that's gonna I'm gonna try and like meal prep some little muffins and I think they're pretty healthy who is calling me oh it's Eddie Let's get baking. This is the little after of the muffins. Do as I say, not as I do. Follow the instructions because one, these are a tiny bit burnt and I need to turn the timer off. And also, um, it's not supposed to be like, you guys see how I literally use like whole oatmeal. I don't know why I thought that's what it was supposed to do, but it's you're supposed to ground it up. So it's supposed to be like oatmeal flour so that it makes like a smooth muffin, like a real muffin. And mine's literally just like a lump of oatmeal with blueberries in it. So I don't really know how these are gonna taste. I'm gonna let them cool and then come back to them in a little bit and package them up for tomorrow and stuff for my classes. But. <laughs> I'm not sure how well they're going to taste, but I'll let you guys know what I think about them. But if you make it right, I think it would be a lot better. Finishing off my night. What? <laughs> Why are you look at me? Finishing off my night with The Bachelorette. Normally it's on on Monday nights, but it wasn't because of stupid basketball. I don't know what the deal with that is. Why did The Bachelorette get changed for basketball? I'm confused. I don't know about you, but I'm going to share off my night watching The Bachelorette as usual. I literally like can't miss it. I just have to like sit here and watch it. 
I still haven't done that much of my schoolwork and I'm like kind of stressing out majorly. <laughs> Shh, would you be quiet over there? So I'm pretty much just gonna be sitting here on the couch for the rest of the night, hopefully, hopefully getting some more school stuff done. I did not get done to as much as I wanted today. I feel like I got a lot done, but not like as much as I wanted to. I don't know. But <laughs> Bachelorette takes priority. I'll just do my work while I watch The Bachelorette. That's how I'll get it done. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to subscribe by clicking down below. Give this video a thumbs up for me. Also, don't forget to follow me on Instagram. I'll link that right here. And I'll see you all in my next video. Bye, guys. <laughs>